A very good morning, children. Welcome to the online class of Sri Kokulam Public School, Guruvayur. I am Vijay Lakshmi, your Max teacher. Children, in the last class, you have learned about Roman numbers. How did you find it? Very interesting, right? Okay. So, learn about it more and enjoy it. Okay. So, in this class, we are going to do more problems from the textbook. So, watch the video and learn the lessons properly. Okay? So, shall we start? Today, we will do some more problems in the, from the chapter Large Numbers. First, let us do some more problems in Roman numerals. And before that, let us recollect the Roman numbers from 1 to 10. 1 is equal to i, 2 is equal to i, i, 3 is equal to i, 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 4 is equal to i and 4, v, 5 is equal to v, 6 is equal to v, i, 7 is equal to v, i, i, 8 is equal to v, i, 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 9 is equal to i and x and 10 is equal to x. If we knew the numbers from 1 to 10, it will be easy for us to do or find out the other problems also. Now, let us do some exercises based on this. 34. 34 is written as 30 plus 4. And that can be written as 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 4 which is equal to x, x, x and the 4. That is IV. Next, 28 which is equal to 20 plus 8 which can be written as 10 plus 10 plus 8. And as X stands for 10, we have 10 X, X and for 8 we have V, I, I, I. Next, 15 which is equal to 10 plus 5. We know that X is equal to 10. And V is equal to 5. So the answer is XV. Next, 19. Which is equal to 10 plus 9. And we know that 10 is equal to X. And 9 is equal to IX. So the answer is XIX. Next, 26. That is equal to 20 plus 6. And 20 can be written as 10 plus 10 plus 6. Which is equal to x, x and v, i. v, i stands for 6. And last one is 13 which is equal to 10 plus 3 and 10 is x and 3 is i, i, i. So the answer is x, i, i, i. So I think now it will be easy for you to uh, write the numbers in a better way. Okay. So, now let us do some mental max. Which digit is in the lakhs place in the number 3,98,105? When we read it itself, we can find the answer, isn't it? So, the answer is 3. Now, what is 5,299 rounded off to the nearest 100? When we have to round a number to the nearest 100, we have to see the digit in the tens place. So, what is the digit in tens place? 9. And so, it is greater than 5. So, it is rounded up to 5300. Now, what is 2990 rounded off to the nearest 1000? We know that the digit in hundreds place is 9 and it is more than 5. So, it is, so the number is rounded to 3000. What is the Hindu Arabic numeral for X, 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 V, I, I? We know that X stands for 10. So 10 plus 10 plus 10 is equal to 30. And V, I, I stands for 7. So the answer is 37. Now let us do some more practice. Choose the correct answer. The difference between the place value and face value of the digit 1 in 
one lakh twenty three thousand four hundred and fifty six is dash. So we have to choose the correct answer. We know that the place value of one is one lakh, and the face value of one is one. So when you subtract the numbers, you get the answer as ninety nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. So the option three is the correct answer. Now, in which number is the digit five in the ten thousands place? We can easily see that the second option is the correct one. Now, which of this is a valid Roman number? V V V. We know that the uh, alphabet or the numeral V cannot be repeated. Also, in the second option we have four I's. We know that the number Mm, I cannot be repeated more than three times, but the number X X X is repeated three times, and so the answer is correct. That is X X X is correct. So the third option is correct. Now write the numbers for the number name nine lakh. Ninety-two thousand nine hundred and nine. So, what will the answer be? Yes, nine lakh ninety-two thousand nine hundred and nine. Now, one lakh one. We can see that the digit in the ten thousand place, thousand place, hundreds place, and tens place is missing here. So, we can put zeros in these places, and the answer is. One comma zero zero comma zero zero one, and which is one lakh one. So now, children, we have done almost all the problems in the textbook. So practice more problems of the same, and learn the lesson properly. Watch the YouTube video, and do the activity which I have given. Also, do the worksheet. and send it to me to see me okay see you again with another lesson until then goodbye stay safe and stay home.